the shoe. Now, a running shoe is a bit better than a flip-flop. And if you are starting, you might not have a tennis or a paddle shoe. So you can start with a running shoe, but be aware that you don't have that stability in the ankle. So the more you play, the more you run, the more you risk rolling your ankle if you're using a running shoe. What you really want to do is to step up to a paddle shoe and quite often a tennis shoe will do. In the olden days, and I say olden days, and it's only five or six years ago, they changed the surface of the World Paddle Tour so there's less sand on the surface. Before there was a lot of sand on the surface and therefore you really needed a herringbone sole where it zigzags on the bottom with deep grooves to make sure that you can hold your position in that sand. Now there's less sand on the surface so often an all-court tennis shoe or a clay-court tennis shoe will be just as good and you can start there.